uh, subscribers today for checking out I'm your angel by Katrina Velarde and Bud Kyle sorry um, today we're checking out this I wanted to give this a shot because Katrina came out with two songs recently so I want to give this one a shot then we'll do the newer one later um, you guys kept requesting some of the Katrina songs so I'm gonna do this one I hope you guys enjoy I know the other one was more requested but I want to do first this one and then the other one because then I know in which order I'm going by because uh, she's been dropping a lot of stuff recently so I wanted uh, to uh, do both songs you know eventually so yeah we can start recording in three two one go and also, if I'm a bit down, I'm sorry, I'm a bit worried about what's going on with the virus. I cannot say its name because YouTube uh, you, uh, censors it, you know, demonetizes your video. But I'm a bit worried about it and um, I don't know what to say. Um, it's very cold here and I don't know, I'm just feeling a bit down. So hopefully this cheers me up a bit and I'm sorry if you're going through the same stuff. Uh, I know it doesn't affect younger people, however, I think everyone should take precautions to protect older people and I don't know, I'm just a bit sad. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. But yeah, we can... Okay, we started recording already. Let's just see this. Hopefully this cheers me up a bit. Hopefully this passes soon. Oh, I love how gentle that is. Uh, I already feel better. Like, I already feel better hearing her. I missed her voice. She has such a beautiful, beautiful voice. I hope I can, uh, like, ask her to do a cover of um, a Dangerously in Love again on her channel because I don't think she has it on her channel. She did it live, but I want to see it on her channel again. Oh, yeah. Nice. No right of us to act for you to make it across. All you have to do mm, pretty. is believe it when you pray. And then you will see the morning will come. Oh, Michael is here. Oh, I forgot that with a hell is uh, Michael and uh, oh, I forgot their all of their names. Michael and oh my god, I'm so sorry I forgot the names in the group, but I know all of them. I reacted to all of them even separately. Nice. A beautiful falsetto, I love when she does that. It's so effortless for her. It's so beautiful. When you call me, I am your angel. And I win all hope. Nice. No matter how far you are, I'm near. It makes no difference who you are. I am your angel. Pretty. I'm not too sure what um, from who the song originally is. Like you guys know, I don't listen to a lot of um, slow songs or ballads. I don't listen to a lot of them. I usually do them on my channel, but I, in my personal time, I don't like to listen to very sad and slow music. That's not, not something I listen to in my free time, so I'm not too sure who is it by. I'll Google it later, but it sounds like something a Mariah would sing or something. Like, a bit older. This sounds like a bit of an older song, so, you know, it's probably not in my realm for now. But I do like to listen to people sing ballads, so it's kind of contradictory, but I don't listen to original songs. I usually listen to covers because, you know, I have my favorite singers, so I want to check them out covering some ballads. I don't know. Maybe that's a bit weird, but I hope you understand. <laughs> I'm your angel. Nice. Oh, beautiful. I saw the teardrop and I heard your cry. I forgot his name. What is his name? His name isn't Daryl. 
Michael Darrow. Who is it that I found? Boo. Bugoy. <gasps> it's Budakel because it's Bugoy, Daryl, and Michael. So, Kel. I think that's. I had an epiphany. Uh, if it's wrong, tell me. <laughs> I love his voice. He has more special voice out of them. obsess over their names because I usually forget names even in real life to people who I know so that's what happens with me I don't know why but I cannot remember names but this might be Daryl I'm not too sure but it's like kind of logical that Bugoy, Daryl and Michael make Budakal <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce that <laughs> oh this is him he maybe dyed his hair or something Nice. Nice. I love the harmonies as well. It's so beautiful. They all look so different here. Beautiful riff. Oh, that was a bit chaotic because everyone was singing at the same time. So it's a bit chaotic, but I do like it. Pretty. <laughs> Also, if I ever say riff and run, I keep confusing them. You know, a riff is when you um, when you go down the note scale, and I think run is when you go up. Riff. No, it's completely opposite. I'm sorry. <laughs> so if I ever confuse them, to me, they sound pretty similar in English, riff and run. So to me, it's very confusing. So if I ever say riff and, I, and she did run, please excuse that. I'm... My brain cannot process those two. <laughs> nice. Nice. pretty good actually I don't know who it's by but it's pretty good it could be like a boys to men song as well it has some characteris characteristics of it Oh, I like that. Like, I like when they do a acapella part. It's really beautiful. I love to hear their voices without the music as well. No <clears throat> That's such a good voice. I love the rise for this. It's almost sensory overload, too much at the same time, a bit. Not a critique, I love all of them, just a bit too much. I cannot focus on 
her doing the riffs and runs and then him doing like uh, ad libs and then everyone else singing ah oh, it's too much <laughs> really high. Mm, impressive. Nice. Oh, beautiful. That little note was pretty. Nice. Oh, I love that harmony. That was really pretty. Nice. Okay, who is it originally? Robert Kelly? You mean R. Kelly? Oh, Celine. Okay, Celine and R. Kelly. Okay, I don't think it's a good idea to <laughs> do cover of R. Kelly's song. I mean, you should kind of separate the man from the actions and his music, but let me stop recording, let me tell you what I thought about it. It's a bit risky with what happened with R. Kelly, um, but let's not talk about that, let's talk about the performance. I think it was really beautiful. I love Katrina, I think she, do, she does amazingly. I'm glad they put the credits down there because um, I wanted to know who this song is by. Let me just see Riff and Run. Riff. Versus hmm. Okay, run is when you go down. <laughs> Riff is up. Okay, okay, okay. So, so, so sorry because. To me, riff and run sound very similar, and when I when I say riff or run, it doesn't matter. Like you know what I mean. <laughs> Sometimes some uh, stuff is very different in my language the way we say it, and then I cannot really connect it to my brain in English. Some small words, but usually I'm pretty fluent in English, so you know I learned it by myself, and I'm still trying to expand my vocabulary and everything. But some words are very hard either for me to pronounce and not stumble over my words or just hard to memorize the different meanings of the words that are similar. That's sometimes really hard for me as someone who, you know, isn't a native speaker of English. But let me tell you what I thought about it. First of all, beautiful, beautiful arrangement. I really like the arrangement. I do think it was overcrowded at times. I do think it got a bit overcrowded at the ends and uh, when they were doing, everyone was doing their own thing. It got a bit, too much for me like nothing against them i love them all they all have beautiful voices just i think arrangement was beautiful in most stuff the only thing i didn't like was everyone at the same time at one point and it was kind of too much for me maybe i should have turned the volume down and it would have been fine but because it was so loud in my ears i don't know i didn't um i don't know i didn't like that that much but everything else amazing i loved katrina's falsettos, I loved her beautiful notes, I loved her riffs and runs, I loved everyone riffs and runs, everyone did a bit of everything, you know, I liked high notes from Michael, I liked ad libs from Daryl and from, uh, from, 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 from Daryl and uh, Bukoy, yeah, I'm right, Bukoy, Daryl and Michael, I'm right, I was right, my theory is right, on their name okay so <laughs> so hopefully i didn't um maybe i messed up only bukoy and daryl did i mess up their names like did i mix them up i don't know tell me but 
I think everything was beautiful. I think uh, the arrangement of the song was very, very pretty. I love the melody. I have never heard this song. I don't listen to R. Kelly. Uh, I'm not someone who usually listens to Celine. I listened to a few of her songs when I was a kid and that's about it. Uh, she's not something I... Um, her songs are very ballady type and I don't really enjoy those, like I said. So, you know, not enjoy, I don't listen to them, you know, on my off time, so, you know, that's why I didn't know the song, I'm so sorry. I know a lot of people are like, oh, it's a classic, but I don't have to know the classics, you know, <laughs> because I live in a different country, like, and uh, I'm not American, I'm not someone who enjoys that much of a American classic. Mostly, I do enjoy hip-hop classics, R&B classics, I don't enjoy ballad classics or pop classics that much. To me, like, it's... I don't care about that, but I do enjoy the way they interpreted this song. I I cannot say, like, I don't know that I heard this original, so I cannot really talk about that, but I know their voices matched really, really nicely together. I loved their harmonies. Harmonies were beautiful, beautiful. I loved the acapella part, the little acapella part that they did. I wish it was a bit longer so I can hear their voices a bit more. So beautiful. I think they have great chemistry together when it comes to singing. I feel like they almost feel like a family. Um, beautiful singing together and harmonies were incredible. I loved um, I loved Bugoy's voice. I think he has like one of the best voices. I love raspy voices in general and voices with some texture. I do love clear voices as well, but voices with some texture give me some mm, soul. Give me some... I don't know how to explain it, but they give me something that I really enjoy, so I hope you uh, understand what I mean. <laughs> but I really loved everything about it. I think everyone got the chance to shine, which is great. I think uh, Katrina did a good job in arranging this song, so everyone got their part, and everyone got to harmonize together. That's why this song is six minutes long. They did it so, like, everyone can shine, and that's really good. I think she did an amazing job at arranging this. I'm glad she's, like, exploring stuff with, you know arranging and with everything I wish for her to be more, you know, active in those parts because it's really interesting to hear it and I really, really enjoyed it. Let me give this video a like. Please go subscribe to Katrina. I think she deserves more support from us and go like the video and support it and see it and check it out on your own without me pausing. Uh, I pe Sometimes people are very, how do I say, very not nice about me pausing and talking but it's a reaction video of course not just a reaction but a review as well because I like to express my opinion I like to pause as well as it deteriorates you from just watching this video and not checking out the original I always tell you go check out the original before however even if you don't want to check it out before you will probably check it out after because of how much I pause and how much I talk about it and you know discuss it so I think it's a good thing to do in the reaction videos, I don't like people who don't pause at all because they basically just took the video and re-uploaded it on their channel and then they tell their opinions afterwards, but most people don't even come for opinions, so that's really weird for me. Like, they, most people just come to see you watch something and that's... I don't know, I don't like that style of reactions and that's why I'm not doing it. So I don't want to have to explain myself every time <laughs> in every, you know, person's um, reaction, why I pause, why I cut, why everything. and. Of course, YouTube also doesn't like people who don't catch up reactions because copyright is there. So, you know, just um, understand I'm not doing it uh, for bad reasons. I'm doing it for good reasons. So you can check out the original and so I don't get copyrighted. So, yeah, I hope you enjoy my reaction. Love you guys so much. This cheered me up a lot and I'm ready to take on other videos that I have chosen for today. I hope you guys enjoy them and I love you so, so much. And I can't wait to see you again. I love you. Bye.